Imagine getting an AI research roadmap from the chief scientist of OpenAI, Ilya Satskiver. Well, that's exactly what happened when Ilya shared his top paper recommendations with tech legend John Carmack to understand the state of affairs in AI today. Now, this list was basically just a randomly ordered list of papers that Ilya shared with John Carmack to understand you know, uh, how he can leverage some of these technologies and uh, the recent uh, research in AI in the gaming industry. So today in this video, we are going to break down Ilya's list to understand how one should consume all of these papers. Now, this list was a randomly ordered list of papers. So the first thing that I did was to put them in logical categories from foundational concepts to evolution of neural network architectures to further specialized applications and recent advancements and challenges. Let's look at this entire roadmap here. Let's start off with the first category, which is foundations and fundamentals. Now here you have to understand the theoretical underpinnings of information complexity and efficient representation in AI. The first resource is a book on Kolmogorov complexity and algorithmic randomness. This is to grasp the fundamental limits of compression and its relation to intelligence. Then we have a tutorial introduction to the minimum description length principle. This is to learn how to balance model complexity with the, the data fit. Then we have keeping neural networks simple by minimizing the description length of the weights. Here, you have to explore the techniques for creating efficient and generalizable neural networks. Now, this is more detailed post. In fact, both of these are pretty detailed. You'll have to spend you know, at least uh, a couple of days to understand and go through these papers deeply. Then we have neural network and deep learning basics. Here, you have to master the core concepts and the architectures of uh, neural networks and their applications. First of all, we have Stanford's convolutional neural network for uh, visual recognition. Now, this uh, will give you a comprehensive understanding of CNNs and their application in computer vision. Then we have understanding LSTM networks. So delve into the mechanics of LSTM network, long short-term memory, and their ability to capture long-term dependencies. Then we have uh, unreasonable effectiveness of recurrent neural networks, RNNs, to discover the surprising capabilities of RNNs within this same domain. Then we have advanced neural network architectures. Here you have to explore the evolution of CNN architectures that revolutionized the image recognition. So the first paper, ImageNet classification with deep CNNs. So you understand the landmark AlexNet architecture that kickstarted the entire deep learning revolution. Then we have deep residual learning for image recognition. Here you learn about the ResNets and how skip connections solve the vanishing gradient problem. Lastly, we have identity mapping in deep residual networks to explore the refinements to ResNet architecture for improved performance. Then we have recurrent neural network and uh, sequence models. Here you deep dive uh, into advanced RNN architectures and their applications in the sequence modeling. Firstly, you have uh, recurrent neural network regularization. So you have to learn techniques to prevent overfitting in RNNs. Then we have pointer networks to discover how to use attention to create variable length outputs. Then we have order matters, sequence to sequence for sets to understand how to process unordered inputs with the neural networks. And lastly, we have relational recurrent neural networks to explore RNNs that can reason about entities and their relationships. Then we head over to attention mechanism and transformers. Here you understand the attention mechanism and its revolutionary impact on sequence modeling. So the first paper we have is neural machine translation by jointly learning to align and translate. You learn about the introduction of attention in sequence to sequence models. Attention is all you need, the revolutionary paper. Now here you have to discover the transformer architecture that forms the basis of modern NLP models that is behind models like uh, GPD as well. Uh, part of that architecture is being used in almost all state of the art models today. Then we have memory and reasoning in neural networks. 
Here, you explore advanced architectures that endow uh, neural networks with memory and reasoning capabilities. So the neural Turing machines, this paper is to understand uh, how to augment neural networks with external memory. And then we have a simple neural network module for relational reasoning. Finally, scaling and efficiency in deep learning. Now, this paper, GPipe, easy scaling with micro batch pipeline and parallelism. This is to learn about pipeline parallelism for training very large models and scaling laws for neural language model to discover empirical laws governing the performance of language models as they scale. The next category we have is specialized applications. So here you see how deep learning principles are applied to diverse uh, domains beyond the uh, standard vision and language tasks. So the paper Deep Speech 2, this is to understand end-to-end uh, -end deep learning for speech recognition. We have paper on neural message passing for quantum chemistry. This is to learn how graph neural networks can be applied to molecular property prediction. And lastly, we have multi-scale context aggregation by dilated convolutions. This paper explores techniques for dense prediction tasks like uh, semantic segmentation. Then we have advanced concepts and future directions. Now this will delve into cutting edge concepts that push the boundaries of AI and explore its future potential. So the variational lossy autoencoder, this paper uh, helps you understand advanced generative modeling techniques. Then we have first law of complexo dynamics. This explores theoretical concepts about the evolution of complexity in uh, intelligent systems, quantifying the rise and fall of complexity in closed systems to learn about measuring and understanding complexity in uh, AI systems. Lastly, we have machine super intelligence. This is uh, to contemplate the possibilities and implications of uh, super intelligent AI systems. Now to understand recent advancements in language models, here you'll have to understand the latest techniques that is pushing the boundaries of large language models. First of all, better, faster, large language models via multi-token prediction. Here you have to learn about the improving LLM efficiency through multi-token prediction. What is that all about? Then dense passage retrieval for open domain question answering. Here you explore modern techniques for information retrieval in QA systems. Now retrieval augmented generation for knowledge intensive NLP tasks. Understand how to enhance LLMs with external knowledge. So all of your RAG applications, how they came into being is explained in that paper. Then we have Zephyr direct distillation of LM alignment. Learn about uh, efficient methods for aligning language models with human preferences. Lastly, we have lost in the middle, how language models use long context. Uh, here you discover, now in this paper, you discover the challenges LLMs face with long range context and uh, what are the potential solutions for it. And lastly, we have the category emerging challenges and solution to explore the cutting edge challenges facing AI and the proposed solution. So the first paper here is precise zero shot dense retrieval without relevant labels. Learn about advanced information retrieval without manual labeling. Then we have Alcuna, large language models meet new knowledge. Here you understand techniques for incorporating new knowledge into pre-trained LLMs, uh, which will help you understand some of the fine tuning principles. The perils promises of fact checking with large language models. You explore the potential and limitations of using LLMs for fact checking. And that's been the complete list. And obviously there has been more advancements in this uh, domain. Each of these uh, uh, categories have uh, evolved. It's been a while and that's it. I've given you a very, very high level overview of uh, this list of the papers that uh, Ilya has shared. And each of these papers actually deserve a few hours, if not days of deep dive in order to understand what has been explained. Even from this list, you'll have to pick and choose as per your area of interest. If you would like to get a more nuanced and more detailed post, uh, which explains the ideas and research explained in each of these papers, head over to my newsletter and make sure that you are subscribed. The newsletter goes by the name researchrookie.substack.com. I will be publishing that post soon. And... Uh, that's it. I hope you found this useful. If you did, please uh, do the needful like, subscribe, share it with your peers. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Until then, keep learning and keep building with AI.